Baptiste and stay human, everybody. Give it up for the man. There you go. John, John, you know, I hold here in my hand. I got the the, the 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 card here to talk to one of one of the favorite favorite guests we ever had. Yeah. I think this is the first one of the guests I ever had on either one of the shows that I've done mm -hmm. that I became actual friends with, and that's Neil deGrasse Tyson. Neil Such DeGrasse a lovely fellow. Tyson, man. He's going to be out here in just a little right. while. It's incredible. Always fast. Always fast. Yeah. I can listen to him talk about anything. I hope he's wearing a vest tonight. Oh, yeah, he has those cool vests. He has vests. a cool vest. He sometimes vest. he wears it, sometimes he doesn't. Yes. I don't know. I got a lot of money on him wearing the vest tonight. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I get the feel. Yeah, I owe a lot, I of, a lot of money if I lose this one. <laughs> I'm also going to try to get him to admit that Pluto is a planet. I'm going to try to get oh, him Oh, yeah. To, I don't think he wants to, to go to there, that maybe, one. Right? No, he may not want to, but, you know, I'll work him. I'll yeah, work get him. get in there. <laughs> Folks, um, Putin's invasion of Ukraine has repeatedly targeted civilians and created a humanitarian disaster. But there's one organization that's been on the ground helping people from the very beginning, and that's Chef Jose Andres' World Central Kitchen. And so far... <laughs> lovely fella. Another friend of the show. So far in this conflict, Jose and his organization have served over 10.3 million meals in more than 80 Ukrainian cities and towns, along with more than 60 refugee assistance centers. But on Saturday, one of his charity kitchens was destroyed by a missile, which is horrible, but not as horrible as it could have been, according to Jose. We got four wounded uh, uh, friends, but, but they are okay. And today, they moved the kitchen. Uh, they are going to be cooking tomorrow in another location. You see, the goodness always shines through, and we're going to keep cooking and feeding as many people as we can. And we only do it because we have your support. They're going to keep cooking. And if you'd like to help support World Central Kitchen, do that in Ukraine and around the world. Visit their website, worldcentralkitchen.org. And please tune in two weeks from tonight when my guest here in the Ed Sullivan Theater will be Chef Jose Andres himself. Catch it. <laughs> the folks, wonderful organization, wonderful group of people. Great human being. Folks, I'm sure you know I'm a huge fan of dogs. Not only are they man's best friend, they are the only friend you're allowed to put on a leash in public. <laughs> and because I love dogs, I also love my segment, Rescue Dog Rescue, where we help find homes for real rescue puppies. And I'm proud to say that so far, we have a perfect record of every single dog we feature getting adopted, which is why... <laughs> which is why tonight... I'm so excited to announce it's time for another edition of Rescue Dog Rescue. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, if you've watched it before, you know how she works. We're about to show you some adorable puppies that are actually up for adoption through North Shore Animal League America. And to make sure those dogs find a forever home, we have made up some flattering lies about each of these puppies to make you want to adopt them even more. Now, if only there were some celebrity willing to help me. Hey, Steven. <laughs> what? Did I hear what? celebrity? What? I did. Yeah. I said, hello. Good Hi. to see you. Hi, good to see you. Oscar Isaac. Hey, everybody. Hello. Holy cow. Hi. Man, Oscar. Yeah. Oscar, what on earth are you doing here? Well, you know, I'm, I'm doing a research for a, for a movie where I play an adorable rescue dog. Really? What, yeah, what, yeah, what's yeah. it about? Well, it's, a, it's about a group of puppies that form an a NHL uh, team. It's called Stanley Pup. <laughs> really? No, no, I'm just practicing lying about dogs. Oh, wow. Yeah. You are good. <laughs> so good. All right, let's, let's get these puppies adopted. First up, this... This, this is Sterling. Mm -hmm. Sterling has memorized all the bathroom codes for every Starbucks in the country. <laughs> Adopt him. Adopt him and say goodbye to all those awkward looks from the barista when you rush in and don't buy anything. It's great. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. This, this, this little one. This is Alma. That means soul in Spanish. She's a champion marathon runner. Even better, she's agreed to attach your Fitbit to her collar. So now, all those steps can be yours. That's nice. Yeah. 
Hugo Alma. Alma. This is Babs. You know that thing when you order a milkshake and they bring out an extra portion in a metal cup? That was her idea. Yeah. Good job, Babs. Oh, yeah. hey, you. This, this is Goose. Hey, Goose. Oh, look at Goose. Goose was one of my co-stars in the movie Dune. Yeah, she, she played the most challenging role of all, Timmy Chalamet's soft, fluffy hair. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hard to wrangle. It's really hard to wrangle. Yeah. This is Chantal. <laughs> While you're sleeping, Chantal goes to your computer and unsubscribes from all the spam emails <laughs> clogging your inbox. So, in the morning, the only special offer waiting for you is a snuggle and probably boner pills. You're gonna need those. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this little bitch right here is Maggie. She is a huge Star Wars fan uh, who goes to all the conventions and one time even got to meet Harrison Ford. So, adopt this dog and she can tell you what Han Solo's butt smells like. This is Crinkles. <laughs> Crinkles is a renowned high-stakes gambler. He, he cleans up at the craps table, but you will have to clean up the craps floor. Well, that does it. Yes, yes, yes you do. That does it for Rescue Dog Rescue. Head to Late Show's website, ColbertLateShow.com, for info on how to adopt these dogs from North Shore Animal League America, and head to Disney Plus to see Oscar Isaac in Moon Knight. Oscar Isaac, everybody. Oscar, says, come on. We'll be right back. Will we? We will.